Hello and back again to the second part of my tutorial about using multiple controllers with Bitwig. So what I now did is I added also a beat step by Arturia to the setup. Now what I wanted to do with that one is to have DJ equalizer in the master bus so I can do some DJ effects on there. And I always want to control the knob and to use these knobs of beat step to control exactly that block in and not hop it to another plugin for example to the polysynth when I play it here. So what you need to do to do that is I open up again the studio IO panel and you see now there is also the beat step has turned up there and you see he's following the current channel on the push which is currently selected the second track the pad but we don't want that we want to have that to control the plugin on the master channel so what we need to do first is we select the master channel so you see we go to the master channel here but now we can pin it so now the beat step is pinned to that channel and will not leave it again and we also pin it to this EQ DJ effect. So after that, if we go somewhere else here, go back to the pad, you see it will stick to that. And let's see if that works. So, okay, we can control it with that one here. So let's start something here and we can turn down the bass, bring it up again and still play our sounds here. That's about it. And you can even go on and go on with that, having other gear controlling other plugins. And yeah, you're only limited by your creativity. So have fun using these setups and make some funky music.